fraud. It's false advertising too. But L'Oreal. Wow, Ethan, great movie. Uh, the mascara gate. So after a full week of silence, Michaela, the ma the mascara gate girl, returned to TikTok to address mascara gate. In her return, she began the video by saying, "Well, I think we all know why we're gathered here. Check this out. Here she is." I'm sure we all know why we've all gathered here today. Why is she talking like that? Right off the bat. It's the month of love, bitches. Anyone who knows me knows I'm not fucking around. Carrie on fucking day, okay? Fisher. Like these, these wait, wait, that's she a real voice. She just said it's the month of yeah, love, yeah. bitches. She sounds like Carrie Fisher. I can't totally. It's yeah. wild. Well, so she used this as an opportunity yeah. to promote something else. I guess. <laughs> Many and of the fans were nothing. Yeah. Uh -huh. Many of the fans were prepared to hear the explanation. However, she did a four-part. Just Valentine's Day makeup. So That's she didn't even name. acknowledge it. Mm -mm. Someone, um, someone commented, "Are you going to talk about the elephant in the room?" And she says, "I reference elephants in this video," and she doesn't like <laughs> reference Mascara Gate at all. Talk about the allegations. <laughs> so she's she's skirting around yeah. it. I mean, in a way, it. like this is probably the best thing she can do. That's what that's what um, people online are saying. It's like just move on. Because, because what is there to say? Yeah, you know. It's just a, like it's just a dub thing. She didn't like harm anyone necessarily, so I would just try to. I would if I was. This, look, if I was her, this would never happened. <laughs> I, this Talk was talked about, about uh, last Friday, right? The day that I was yeah. out. So just to remind me, this was it was like a sponsored post about some mascara or something. Yes, and she claimed she wasn't wearing any. There was a bef a moment yeah. where people are sure. That she put on fake fakies, as they're called. For fakies. showing the after of using Falsies. the mascara, you know? And it was like a big brand. It was like L'Oreal or yeah, something. Yeah, it was L'Oreal. Right, okay. I, I remember, yeah, it's I remember just, looking it over. Uh, okay. Is the ads, is the video still up there? Yes, it is. Wow. Not backing down. And I, oh my God, another Vaseline. Uh, I've got I a Vaseline bestie. Take it off. I can't. Wait, look at this shit. Take it off. I, I thought I was looking in the mirror for a second. <laughs> like... Dude, that's wild. I'm sorry. I don't care. I, I, I can. Do you really do that? You rub Vaseline all over your face? Some people use a balm to take off their makeup. Oh, oh, balm. Yeah, I just sent um in chat a <laughs> screenshot of some of the comments. <laughs> bomb them. Bob, Bob, Bob. <laughs> Here's some of the comments. Let's take a look. Sorry, Eli, cut you off a minute ago. You don't remember? No. <laughs> Now, Mick, you know what you did there in the beginning. Well, obviously, she's back and unbothered. Love to see it. So I guess people okay. don't care. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Nah. She's... I mean, faking that kind of stuff in like a makeup commercial. I mean, is that not every single well, makeup commercial ever? No. Like, I know it's different because it's an influencer. I guess yeah. so it's supposed to feel. I more think real. for other beauty influencers, and I'm only going to guess here. I think it's like a big problem because they are very truthful. I'm assuming. Right. Right. And she's not here. I guess that's fair. Because I yeah, just I think of like seeing like I mean, it's fraud. It's false advertising too. But L'Oreal. Right. But like, is it not when they have a TV commercial that's on during the nightly news and it's like, you know, supposedly somebody using the product, but you know, on a commercial, I, it's all fake. He, no, I, I think that sure. they probably do so. have to use the product. Or there'd be really? false, I mean, I think they have like the best people in the world to make it look as good as possible. I guess. I'm sure they Might use fake right. eyelashes in commercials, but with specifically know. to influencers, it's their job to be yeah. honest. Exactly. With their, with like, their, okay. you know that's, how, that's um, that's you know how tech, tech influencers have a lot of like rules Sure. Amongst the themselves. Yeah, yeah, for the credibility. So I'm, I'm assuming it's the same for the beauty. That makes total sense. Yeah. 